you, Matt. Families are demanding that charges be filed against the driver of a concrete truck that crashed into a school bus full of pre-K students in Bastrop last week. According to court documents, the driver admitted to DPS troopers he had smoked marijuana the night before the crash, then had some cocaine when he woke up. Dash cam video from the school bus shows the truck veering into oncoming traffic last Friday, forcing the bus driver to swerve and flip over. A five-year-old boy on board the bus was killed, along with a driver of a car traveling behind the bus. The attorney representing the family of a child who survived the crash says his clients are furious. It's bad enough to have a crash that happens, but to learn that it happened because of completely preventable, avoidable factors uh, really makes you angry. Uh, we see it unfortunately all the time with impaired driving, whether by drugs or alcohol. Uh, sleep deprivation is something we see quite often uh, with these commercial drivers. Uh, it's, it's absolutely unacceptable. In addition to suing the driver, the attorney says he's also looking at the manufacturer of the concrete truck to see if lane departure technology could have helped prevent the crash.